Hi everyone, it's Marissa from BumblebeeApothecary.com and today I'd like to show you how to make a delicious and super nutrient dense treat that's perfect for this time of year and that is eggnog. been enjoying a lot lately. I love how it packs so many nutrient-dense superfoods that are helpful just for in general and if you're following the GAPS diet, all into one really delicious treat. The recipe that I'm using is based off of the one in this book, GAPS Stage by Stage with Recipes by Dr. Becky Plotner, and then I've kind of just tweaked it a little bit as far as the preparation to make it turn out really nice. So I'm going to show you how to make this. So I'm gonna start with one cup of cultured cream. So this is grass-fed cream that I've cultured with kefir. You can do this a couple of ways. You can add grains to it and then strain the grains out or you can just add some kefir. That's what I like to do because it saves me a step of having to strain the grains out later and it still works great. So I just added some kefir to this, about three tablespoons to this whole jar and then let it sit on my counter for 48 hours. It's a little cooler this time of year, so it took that long to culture until it was nice and thick. And then I'm going to whip it. I have my immersion blender with this whisk attachment. I'll link this one below if you're looking for one of these, but I really like this one. And just whip it until it's like cultured whipped cream. Getting close, it's like almost a soft peak stage. That's looking pretty good. I'm gonna go just a little bit more so they're a little bit stiffer peaks. All right, that looks really good. Next, I'm just gonna add the rest of my ingredients. So I'm gonna be doing two eggs. Now I've talked about raw eggs before on my channel and this is definitely something you wanna do your own research about. Make sure you're comfortable with it. Talk to your doctor if you have health conditions, all that kind of stuff. I personally only eat raw eggs if I really trust the source. I want them to be from organic chickens out on pasture, on grass, eating bugs, fed organic feed. I generally only use raw eggs from our chickens that we raise in our backyard since I know how fresh they are and everything. In my research that I did, salmonella should not be a problem if they're from very healthy chickens, but those are the things to consider. Dr. Natasha, who wrote the GAPS diet book, talks a lot about all of the great nutrients that are in raw egg yolks. Great source of a lot of different really important nutrients. And then the raw egg whites are actually helpful at naturally and gently detoxing heavy metals. So I thought that was pretty nifty. And if you're wondering, this is a GAPS approved recipe. Dr. Becky's recipe in this book, which is this recipe, she says is okay as early as stage two, as long as you're doing okay with all these different individual ingredients. So if you are having this on stage two gap, you wanna use just the egg yolks, and then once you're in stage three, you can add the egg whites. So I'm just gonna add two raw eggs to this. Next, I'm going to add, I kind of eyeball these next measurements, about a teaspoon of vanilla extract. And then I'm gonna add about a quarter of a teaspoon of ground nutmeg. Again, I just tend to eyeball these things, but quarter teaspoon should be good. Next, I'm going to add honey to taste. And this is really gonna vary depending on what you like and what you're doing well with. For this amount, I usually add about two teaspoons of raw honey. And then I'm just going to whip that all together. All right, that looks great. And then it's ready to pour into cups and enjoy. All right, and there you have it. There's a gaps. I mean, anybody off the gaps diet too would really enjoy this eggnog that is made with real superfood ingredients, that grass-fed cultured cream has lots of great nutrients as well as beneficial probiotics,
And then you have those great raw egg yolks in there as well. So super yummy, lots of people can enjoy it and so good for you. Like I said, I'll have a link below to this immersion blender in case you're looking for one as well as one of my favorite places to buy organic groceries. Hope that you guys enjoyed this video and I hope that you try this eggnog and if you do leave me a comment and let me know what you think of it. If you like this video give it a thumbs up, share it with anybody else you think would like it. If you're new to my channel please hit that subscribe button. I get out two videos every week on nourishing recipes and natural living. Thanks so much for watching. See you next time. Bye!